Hello and welcome. In this video installation, I'm going to show you one method of lubricant testing using the rotary drive on the UMT TriboLab. We're going to set up a Strebeck curve test. In this test, we vary the test conditions to take the sliding interface through all three lubrication regimes, namely boundary, mixed, and hydrodynamic. It should be noted that there is no existing ASTM or ISO standard lubricant test for developing a Strebeck curve, so Bruker has developed one for use with the TriboLab. The test can be conducted using virtually any liquid, and the user can set the load, speed, and temperature according to their own preferences, depending on their end-use applications. The user can choose also from a variety of upper samples with varying sizes and contact geometries. While I'm going to run this demo at room temperature, a combined cooling and heating chamber is also available for the Tribo Lab. Here we see the rotary drive in the UMT with the liquid chamber installed in the lower and upper polished steel samples. I'm going to install the recirculation insert and add the lubricant. I'm going to lower the pin sample into position and we'll hit OK to start the test. And you can see that as we run through the speed, starting at 15 RPM, we go to 30 RPM, and we go to 45 RPM, and collect the data, and we'll go all the way up to 2500 RPM, as shown in this view at the end of the test. Once the test is completed, we can go to the viewer, and open a file and by pressing the Strebeck button and changing the axes to coefficient of friction to velocity, we automatically plot the Strebeck curve. Here we see an example of two repeats of Strebeck curves run at three different temperatures. The Strebeck test using the rotary drive and different environmental chambers are just some of the tests one can use for screening lubricants on the UMT Tribolab.